hello dear students welcome back to my channel this is the video series for 9th standard students who will be facing public exam this is the part 2 of maths important questions dear students already have learnt 5 questions in the previous video if you have not watched the video do watch the complete video and also do join my whatsapp channel and also telegram group i will be posting all these videos and the worksheet in my telegram group definitely it will help you to clear your concepts and score better in your examination not to worry do practice on a daily basis definitely you can score good marks in maths first question find the reminder when x cube minus a x square plus 6 x minus a is divided by x minus a here p of x is x cube minus x cube minus a x square plus 6 x minus a let p of x equals x cube minus a x square plus 6 x minus a g of x is x minus a now we need to find out the value of x that is x minus a equals equate g of x equals to 0 now g of x is what x minus a now shift minus a to rhs what you get is x equals a now substitute the value of x equals a in p of x replace x each and every variable x by what a now what you get is p of a equals a cube minus a into a square plus 6a minus a now plus a cube minus a cube will cancel out now 6 into a 6a minus a 6a minus a is 5a therefore the reminder the reminder is what 5a by reminder theorem what what is the what are the steps equate g of x equals to 0 find out the value of x or any other variable involved substitute it that is in what are the value we get for example if we get x equals k so p of k will be the reminder so there are a few practice questions i have included in, with this worksheet Here, I have replaced a by 3. So, you can find out the value of reminder. Now, second question. Use the factor theorem to determine whether g of x equals x plus 1 is a factor of p of x. That is, what is p of x? 2x cube plus x square minus 2x minus 1 is a p of x and g of x is x minus 1 now again the steps are similar g of x equals what x plus 1 equate it to 0 now we get x equals what minus 1 now what you need to do you need to replace the x by what minus 1 if p of minus 1 equals to 0 that means it is a factor if p of minus 1 is not equal to 0 that means it is g of x is not a factor now replace x by what minus 1 now p of minus 1 equals 2 into minus 1 cube plus minus 1 square minus 2 into replace x by what minus 1 minus 1 now minus 1 cube is what minus 1 into minus 1 into minus 1 that is minus into minus plus plus into minus minus 1 into 1 into 1 is 1 what we get is minus 1 into 2 is minus 2 in the same way minus 1 into minus 1 is plus 1 now minus into minus plus 2 minus 1 as it is plus 2 minus 2 will cancel out plus 1 minus 1 will cancel out what we got p of 1 minus 1 equals what 0 that means by factor theorem g of x the given g of x is a factor of p of x next question find the product of x plus 4 into x plus 10 we should use the identity x plus a x plus b equals what x square plus a plus b into x plus a b see x 
plus a x plus b. What is the value of a here? a is 4, b is what? 10. Replace a by 4, b by 10. We use a equals what? 4, b equals 10. In the formula substitute a equals 4 and b equals 10. What we get is x square plus a plus b is what? 4 plus 10 into x. a b is 4 into 10. 4 plus 10 is 14x. 4 into 10 is 40. Therefore, x plus 4 into x plus 10 equals x square plus 14x plus 40. Very simple formula for, simple problem for one mark. Expand 2x minus y plus z whole square using suitable identity. We know the identity x plus y plus z whole square. That is including uh, the formula involving three, three variables x plus y plus z whole square equals x square plus y square plus z square 2xy plus 2yz plus 2zx 2xy 2yz and 2zx now here we have in place of x 2x in place of y minus y in place of z we have z itself now substitute all these values replace x by what 2x y by minus y z by what z itself x square plus y square plus z square replaced by 2x whole square minus y whole square plus z square now 2x into replace x by what 2x 2x 2 into 2x into minus y 2 into y is what minus y into z plus 2 into z into 2x 2x whole square is what 2 square is 4 x square as it is minus y whole square is plus y whole square minus y whole square is what minus into minus plus we get y square now z square as it is 2 2 is a 4 and plus into minus minus xy in the same way plus into minus minus y into z yz 2 2 is a 4 that is 2 into 2 is 4 z into x zx fifth question find the value of k if x equals 2 and y equals 1 is a solution of the equation 2x plus 3y equals k. So this is the question from the unit coordinate geometry 2x plus 3y equals what k. That means x and y are the solution. That means substitute x equals 2 and y equals 1 in this equation. What you get 2 into 2 plus 3 into 1 equals what k. 2 2 is a 4 plus 3 1 is a 3. Therefore, k equals what? 7. Since it is a solution, LHS and RHS will be equal. It satisfies the equation. Sixth very important question. The angles of a quadrilateral are in the ratio. 3 is to 5 is to 9 is to 13. Find the, all the angles of the quadrilateral. Let the common ratio between the angles be x that is 3x plus 5x plus 9x plus 13x sum of all the angles is what 360 degree the sum of all the angles in a quadrilateral is 360 degree that is 3x plus 5x plus 9x plus 13x equals 360 degree since the variables are these are like terms 3x plus 5x plus 9x plus 13x is 30x now x equals what 360 by 30, 3, 0 and 0 will cancel, 3, 1, sir, 3, 2, sir. we got x equals 12. Now, the angles, the first angle is what? 3x, second is 5x, third is 9x, fourth is 13x. Now, substitute the values, uh, substitute the value of x, 3, 2, sir, 3, 2, sir, 36, 5 into 12 is 60, 9 into 12 is 108, 13 into 12 is 156. Therefore, the angles of the quadrilateral are 36 degree, 60 degree, 108 degree and 156 degree. Dear students, do download this worksheet and solve it. Very important theorem. If the diagonals of a parallelogram are equal, then show that it is a rectangle. Let A, B, C, D be a parallelogram. Here, what is the given condition? The diagonals are equal. What are the diagonals? AC and BD are the diagonals. What we need to show? We need to show that ABC is a right angle. So ABC is a rectangle. If what is the condition? 
if the diagonals of a parallelogram are equal this is in the question itself to prove what we need to prove ABCD is a rectangle to prove ABCD is a rectangle if I prove one of the interior angle is 90 degree that means it is a rectangle now in triangle ABC consider triangle A B C and triangle B A D A B C and B A D what we have we have a common side A B and B A for both the triangles what is the common side A B and A B B C equals what B C will be equal to A D because opposite sides of a parallelogram are equal now AC equals BD it is given in the question that is the diagonals of a parallelogram are equal that means three sides are equal the three sides of a triangle are equal to what another triangle that is which congruency we should use we should use triple S side 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 two triangle are congruent if their corresponding sides are equal so using that in congruent triangles angles will be what equal therefore the corresponding parts of congruent triangle angle A will be equal to what angle B now we know that angle A plus angle B equals what 90 degree so 180 degree angle A plus angle B is 180 degree because the sum of angles on the same side of the transversal the sum of the angles on the same side of the transversal will be 180 degree now these two are same from this equation therefore a plus a is what 2a equals 180 a equals what 90 degree therefore we have proved one of the interior angles in a in a given parallelogram equals what 90 degree therefore abcd is a rectangle hence proved very important theorem try to understand again your which congruency we should use you should use triple s and also the sum of angles on the same side of the transversal will be equal to 180 degree so these are the practice questions dear students do download the worksheet and do solve all these questions definitely it will be useful if you have not subscribed the channel do subscribe the channel and also do join my whatsapp channel and telegram group the link is provided in the description. Thank you.